Red Rover, Red Rover, can interesting science shit come over? We decided to take a different path because it was more scientifically interesting. But occasionally attracts attention. Stay cool. This is a Thor News presentation. Thor News presents... It hasn't all been smooth sailing for the rover on Mars. Ladies and gentlemen, for this Thor's Day special, we're going to go ahead and take the blue pill and pretend that all this information is real. Take your pill and go. We are over at the Washington Post. Speaking of science, Curiosity rover on Mars benched after a short circuit. Get your ass on the bench, Curiosity. Your gameplay is sucking. We're losing big time here in the fourth quarter. You see, NASA's put a long line of rovers on the moon. First, ironically, it was a rover named Short Circuit. He was a spunky little robot with a sense of humor. Built by legacy NASA engineer, Ali Sheedy. Then came WALL-E, a tag team robot mission by Disney and NASA together. Working to propagandize your hearts and your minds to love robots in Martian dirt. And then came Spirit, Opportunity, and now we have Curiosity. And you would think that Curiosity would be the first gay Martian robot, but you would be wrong. That bill actually goes to Short Circuit, who became an LGBT role model after returning to Earth. You go, girl. All right. So what happened? Short story, it's right arm has short circuit from too much dirt fapping. You see, no more selfies for curiosity. And I gotta say, as often as I kid NASA about being mediocre at best, they are the number one space agency in the world at taking selfies. You know, they have maximized social networking from the ground, on the ground, and in the ground better than anybody ever that was associated with space flight exploration. All right, no more selfies for curiosity, for now at least. The famous little Mars rover is taking a few days off after a short circuit on February 27th, set off its fault protection procedures. The rover was transferring rock powder from the drill on its arm to internal instruments when the malfunction occurred. The sample transfer process has been completed several times before. But this time, something went terribly wrong. Once again, kids, let this be the umpteenth lesson to you. That any type of rock powder, whether it be crack or Martian, is bad for you. Don't play with rock powder. Ever. You hear me? We are running tests on the vehicle in its present configuration before we move the arm or drive. This gives us the best opportunity, nice pun, to determine where the shore is. It's possible that the rover is fine and will be able to continue operations as usual. But until the check is cashed, NASA scientists can't be sure. The team may end up having to restrict the use of certain science instruments. Somebody called Grax. What did short circuit predictive programming this event? with its movie posters, where lightning shoots out of its right arm. And I would guess magic lightning could cause a short circuit in a robot that does not believe in magic. Because the science division of Disney will expressly tell you magic is not real, no matter how much you believe in it, or how much it scars your face or your soul. But this is an excellent time for the Curiosity Twitter account, which is run by Poochie the Dog from The Simpsons. This is definitely the time for Curiosity Rover's Twitter account, which is run by Poochie the Dog from The Simpsons, to shine. Because when you think of NASA, we want you to think of Earth and social networking. Beep, 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 boop, 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 beep. Call me Johnny Five. Some ops on hold while my team investigates a short circuit. Like black ops, wet ops, kraken ops. Martian Warlord Ops, an inside look at Mars, analysis underway, and the sample from Yester Soul's drilling. The sun's awfully bright there, man, and that looks gray, like clay. Hey, you don't say. Meanwhile, in the asteroid belt, 
NASA Dawn is almost to dwarf planet Ceres. Way to cross-pollinate there, buddy. You robots are clever. Selfie stick not required. How I take self-portraits. And why my arm isn't in the shot. Like I said, here there be science. New selfie is annotated with recent investigation targets. What I like is the atmosphere up here that looks atmospheric and cloudy and stuff. It almost makes you feel like you could breathe there if you really tried. I dig you like curiosity digs Mars. And the truth of the matter is, most human beings wouldn't know manned space exploration from a hole in the ground. All right, this has been my story. I'll keep you updated. I love you, people, ladies. Selena Gomez and Ariana Grande are way cuter than robots. Now, if they can make robots as cute as Selena Gomez and Ariana Grande, I'm going to have some problems. I'm going to have some big problems. All right, peace out.